In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Glorious Saint Nicholas, my special protector, from that seat of light in which you enjoy the Divine Presence, turn mercifully towards me your eyes and impart to me from the Lord the graces and aids appropriate to my present spiritual and temporal needs, and precisely the grace should it benefit my eternal health. Grant you still, O glorious Holy Bishop, the Supreme Pontiff, the Holy Church and this devout city. Led back to the right path sinners, unbelievers, heretics, and the afflicted, succor the needy, defend the oppressed, heal the sick, and cause all to experience the effects of your valiant patronage with the supreme dater of all good. O Holy Bishop of Christ, Nicholas, who during your earthly life you were a victim of persecution and were invoked by three army commanders unjustly tried and condemned for sedition, Continue to prove the worth of your intercession with the Lord. Even today there are many those who are unjustly condemned. Intercede with God that all those who wield power in all the countries of the world understand the sacred value of life and human freedom. We especially pray to you, O glorious Thaumaturge, for those who suffer for bearing witness to their faith, that they may have the strength to forgive their persecutors, following the example of what Jesus did on the cross. O glorious and holy Bishop of Christ, Nicholas, who from time immemorial you have been invoked as a special protector of those who work or travel on the sea, turn your benevolent gaze upon me. Intercede with God that the sea on which I work may always be a friend to me, and my loved ones may think of me without fear in confident expectation. Do not allow discouragement to take hold of me in time of danger, but remind me always that you are a valid intercessor with God and do not fail to be present alongside those who invoke you. I firmly believe, O oh glorious Saint Nicholas, that your intervention before God will not go unheard by him who calmed the winds and quelled the storm. Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen.